Chains are when either a quick effect, spell speed 2 or higher card is used in response to other cards, or if multiple cards are trying to trigger at the same time. When cards are in a chain, the last card to be added to the chain is the first one to resolve its effect, and then you go backwards from there. For example, if you use Raigeki to try and destroy all your opponent's monsters, and they chain Baron to negate the effect, then you chain Forbidden Droplet, the chain would resolve backwards. Droplet would go first and negate the effects of Baron on the field this turn. Baron would go next and attempt to negate the effect of Raigeki, but not be able to anymore because Droplet has its effects negated. Then Raigeki would go last, destroying all your opponent's monsters because its effect went through without interruption. You can chain as many quick effects to other effects as you want, as there's no limit to how high the chains can get. And there's even cards like Chain Strike that specifically have effects dependent on when it's activated in the chain, although these kinds of effects are not common.